But according to Build Skills Australia, which was launched by the federal government this year to address challenges in the construction industry, we need 90,000 extra tradies for residential construction to get anywhere close to that. And the Master Builders Association said this weekend that it has forecast nearly 500,000 new tradies will be needed over the next three to five years to replenish an ageing workforce and meet growing demand. There is no way, Sam, that this goal is ever going to be reached at the same time as you keep importing more and more people into the country, which puts more and more pressure on well, the Well, I think market. it depends who, who are the people that you're importing. If, if we're importing uh, a bunch of university students who are studying, you know, what did, what did Joe study? You know, gender I studies or, <laughs> or, 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 or something like that. I was, I was not the guys that are going to turn up to, to lay your concrete slab, right? Yeah. If we're going to import people like we did in the 1950s and 60s who are actually skilled in the sense of, yes, they can, you know, lay cable through your house and, and put the pipes under your house, they're the sort of people that we should be getting. And that's exactly what the Labor Party said in, I think it was mm -hmm. December, when they said, yeah, we're going to yeah. wind back on the, on the um, student... Uh, uh, international students and we're going to start to bring in, you know, skilled labourers. Yeah. Well, that's great. But, I mean, we had, what was it, in, in January, 125,000 extra people came into the country. I don't think we brought in 125,000... Sure. Changing policy settings takes time. You know, it takes well, time. You don't, you don't just say, OK, boom, and then everyone that's due to come in that month stopped. Don't yeah, get me wrong. You know I, 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 I agree that building in general, homes. Where in are these general we absolutely to need live? to wind back but on that 105,000 number. This is, yeah. this is why the immigration debate just does my head in. And this is this story, I'm so glad it was written, is the perfect example of it. We cannot build enough homes for the people we have here already, right? We don't have enough yes. housing for the people who are already mm. here because we don't have enough people to build it. And, yes, it sounds paradoxical, but guess what? A builder can build more than just one bedroom. A builder can build more than just one house. A builder can build a number of houses. Therefore, if you bring someone in, like teaching Amanda Fish, if you bring enough skilled labourers in who yeah, can but, build... And to, why hasn't the, the government industry, quite simply... Because everyone's jaw is on the floor. The fact that they imported 373 thousand just last year, yes, which meant that one in 16 people well. in Australia Those today were... came here last year. But we're not doing it for that them, we're doing it for us, we're doing it because we need their skills. Then January's numbers come out, so why doesn't this government have a single firing neuron to tell that to people? Because it would reassure the public massively if they said, well, I think no, no, right no, of the 125,000 people we just imported in the month of January alone, this isn't Labor's big Australia that we're foisting on you guys, we desperately need tradies. Yeah. You want homes? This is how we're building them. And this is the proportion in the 125,000 people that we just let in and you're all scratching your heads wondering what the hell is this government doing? Let us reassure you, this is the plan. This is how many tradies are in there for you guys. They can't do something that's and, simple. And to well, you, know what else, you know what else they could do? You know what else they could do? Is <laughs> actually <laughs> train up Stupid. Australian children mm. in apprenticeships so we have our own people here going off to yes. work in trades. But, of course, that's all been demonised. We can't have all of that. They've put um, more they, money... They've, they've, they've created fee-free TAFE places. They are doing that. Yeah, but we haven't they seen... They are rolling it, it out. In, in the TAFE It's in the budget. It's in the budget. I'm sorry, I'm annoying. sorry, Joe. I'm sorry, Joe, but the number of apprenticeships in this country over the last 10 years, and it continues, was, has it was, been dropping. Yes, after the that break. was the coalition. After the that break. was the coalition government. <laughs> yeah, now we've got a Labor government. After yes, the and they've made TAFE free so we can get more builders trained up in this country. How is that hard to understand? It wouldn't be a show without Joe Because Luke there's no take-up.